Okay guys, let's try again here with the animal dog, the DY New Sunder, the direct competitor to the, or the exactly the same boat hull at least, the same hull as the animal cat. Let's see if we can get some decent speeds. My last number, I just uh, can't remember if it was 138 or something. So now I just I just pulled the batteries a bit further back. It was running very wet. So so now I think I think it's it's gonna run faster now since I pulled the batteries back uh, about three two three centimeters, which is quite a bit. But it was also running so wet that it was cutting out on me so i guess we are not stretching anything by doing so See what we can do here. Reset the GPS. We got 12 satellites already. Track start. Let's turn on the remote. Oh, we can do that when we get to the water actually. And here you can see things are registering. Still got movements. That's not sent the phone, but uh, hope you guys can see. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Send it out here so that we have, so that we can actually see it from when we go up here, where we have better signal for one and also better view to get it all the way down there because we have about 300 and 300 about 300 meters we have from end to end, so we need to take advantage of as much of the lake as we can if we are to do some. Decent speeds. Let's see here. Hope you guys are having a good view here. I'm just gonna reposition the camera. Yeah. Yeah. 
we had a cutout again. But uh, I think we got some more speed anyway. At least it's running very stable. <laughs> so I cannot bring the batteries further back now, so I will need to adjust the angle of the struts up a little bit if I wanted to increase the speed and also have it run a little less wet which we want increasing speed decreasing stability that's always the trade-off when we do when we do this so let's see what we got And read 155 so getting closer getting faster and faster every one every run so uh, should we try another one track start or maybe we should just adjust the struts a little bit yeah let's just try that just a tiny bit of adjustment Let's go then. Yeah, I'm back. So yeah, let's adjust the struts just a little bit with a 2 or 1.5 mil hex I think this might be the one yeah 1.5 Jeg kan ikke få dem høje op. Nej. Actually, my struts are in the highest position, or they can even get, so... Oh, det er den anden om det, bare. Let's try this one over here. Det er det samme. So this is actually the highest position we can get this one then. That's a shame. But uh, let's go for another run anyway. Sometimes the second pass can be faster. Yeah. That's for another day. <laughs> Let's try just another run where we stand out here. Hopefully not getting bitten. That's the biggest problem today, getting bitten by all those nasty bugs. Okay. So, ready for track. Okay, put track start. And you guys can see here we got movement. Got movement. Let's try a stand over here. We 
We have some beautiful bugs in the air as well here. Okay. And now we just have to. Signal yeah, the signal is so bad up here. I think we are at about the same. We have movement, you can see. Stop, read. 133. So, yeah, it was a short run. But it's pretty fun nonetheless. It's such a fun boat. That's all we get from it today. But a respect, respectably, um, 155, I think it was. So, definitely not too shabby. I will have to probably cut, like Sian just said, I probably have to cut the stand ups down a little bit so that they will be able to go a little bit further up so we can get a little bit. Uh, more of an aggressive angle to have that nose come up just a little bit more um, But this is again the 1817 props on the stock setup from DY